Hello, everyone. Welcome to Coffee in the Cloud. I'm Kara Wano with Microsoft, and I'm here today to review with you all of the Wave 2 Copilot Success Kit updates that my team has made. They are so amazing, and I am thrilled to take you through it. So let's hop in. Welcome back to Coffee in the Cloud, everyone. Again, I'm so happy that you're here. We've been busy over in our team. Uh, of course, our team delivers adoption.microsoft.com, and it is your go-to place for all the content that you need to make sure that you're getting the most out of your investment in Microsoft services. But today, I have special announcements about everything we've done to make sure you get the most out of your Copilot implementation. Microsoft 365 Copilot has a whole new host of features. And if you didn't get a chance to see Satya and Jared make the Wave 2 announcements, why, check out this on demand. You can go see it on LinkedIn. It's a great video. It's not super long, so it'll just be a few minutes. Uh, but you can check out everything that they had to say about our investment and innovation based on your feedback. Also, based on your feedback, we've made some significant updates to the Copilot Success Kit. Now, you know I always say don't start from scratch. You certainly don't want to start from scratch uh, when you're implementing Copilot. This kit has everything from a business leader's overview to technical readiness documentation to our user enablement and human change work stream resources. So whatever your role might be in really leveraging AI for business value, this kit has something for you. Now, I'm going to start with the updates to our interactive scenario library. One of the things that we found so frequently is that business leaders really need some assistance and inspiration about how they can use Copilot and AI capabilities to improve their results. That's exactly what the scenario library is all about. We have updated it with subject matter expert videos, product overview videos, and downloadable content that you can use in these specific functional areas. So maybe you're in HR, or you're in marketing, or you're in IT. We'll give you suggestions about how you can use Copilot to be more efficient and really deliver on more value in your space. Now, if we want to turn to the resources that are available for you to implement Copilot, that's where the Copilot Success Kit comes in. Now, before I drill into this, I want to remind you, we have a Copilot community. And if you have any questions whatsoever, you should join us there. There's people who are going through the journey just like you. It's always great to learn from your peers. Those of us at Microsoft, we can tell you stuff all day long, but when you actually learn from other customers, other IT professionals, or user enablement specialists who are doing this work, that is what is so valuable. So now let's take a look at the different components. Now, the success kit as a whole is pretty large, so it'll take you a little bit to download, but that's because there's so much good stuff in it. You can download individual components, but this time around for Wave 2, I actually recommend you up download the entire kit because then it's all at your fingertips. It comes down as a zip file and you can expand it. Now, of course, most of this content is delivered to you as PowerPoint presentations. What does that mean? It means you can customize them. You can put your own brand on them. You can make changes to them based on your own internal collaboration policies. We really want you to be able to use our materials in your own environment uh, so that you get the most value from them. We have an entirely new implementation summary guide for leaders. So this really gives you an overview of all those three main work streams, what leaders need to be thinking about, what human change folks need to think about, and what you need to do for technical readiness. There's updates to the user enablement guide, to the technical readiness deck itself, which walks you through our optimization wizard and all the steps you need to do to make sure that you're delivering a secure and compliant uh, AI experience. There's more content on accelerating your usage with Microsoft Viva, which is an essential tool for how you drive the rollout and implementation and also how you view who's using what and making sure people are getting the most value uh, from Copilot. Delivering business results with Microsoft 365 Copilot is another thing that has been updated, as well as the highly anticipated Get Started with Microsoft 365 Copilot in Excel for all of my Excel friends out there. 
There's so much that's coming in this space. I know the pace of change is hard, but we are dedicated to making sure that you have everything you need uh, to accelerate your value and to actually understand and be inspired by this opportunity that we all have to use AI in meaningful ways. Remember, this is a career moment for you. So make sure that you're checking out our Copilot Hub also to go and take advantage of our free learning paths that are available on Microsoft Learn. You want to get those badges and put them on your LinkedIn profile. This is an important moment for all of us in technology and in business. Let's lean in, have some fun, and get the most out of these tools. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon.